Hello everybody and I hope you're all staying well during this lockdown and staying safe And today in Inverclyde the forecast is snow And where I stay in Inverclyde there's no snow um, But I've been in contact with my pals through WhatsApp and Facebook and stuff And apparently there's loads of snow up the hill So I'm going to head up there just now and see if I can get any snow pictures um, I'm not going to lie, I absolutely love snow But I love it it's not, to do with, it's not even to do with the photography, I just like it I like building snowmen and sledging I'm a 30 year old man with a 6 year old soul and that's just the way it is so anyway I'm going to head up to Camacombe I'm going to a place called Knapp's Lock um, hopefully it might even be frozen over you never know um, and I will see if I can get myself some decent snow pictures so fingers crossed Right, so now up at Knapp's Lock in Kilmacombe It's really nice, to be honest um, whoa. The snow's not great, it's a bit slushy uh, It's probably a bit deeper further up the road uh, But it was all fields and stuff, so there's not really anywhere I can take any shots um, But up here the, the lock is partially frozen as I thought it would be So there's a big route round here that you can just go, it's like a nature trail So I'm just going to walk round um, And see if there's any shots that I haven't taken before And see if there's anything nice we can get but if I don't get any shots then it's a nice walk in itself, so I'm not bothered. So I'll get going and see if there's anything decent I can find. So I took a walk round the lock there and about halfway round and to be honest there's not much that's having my interest although it's frozen over and it looks absolutely brilliant there's not much there for interest so I was walking past a kind of small kind of woodland I suppose you could call it and I happened to notice some orange leaves in the trees so I decided I'm going to have a look in there and see what that's all about and I don't know how but I'll look at this wee thing It's the only thing in the whole woods with any sort of leaves on it and it's the leaves are really vibrant orange so I'm going to wander about here for a second or two and try and get a shot of this and try and exclude it from everything else so I'm going to go for a wander around and see what I get I'll be honest, I'm really happy with that shot um, After half an hour or so walking around and not finding anything You start to think, oh no, this is going to be a waste of time But that was that was pretty special, that one, it's not often you find that So I'm just going to continue walking around the loch um, There's a lot more woodland and stuff over this side And there's kind of wee intricate shapes and stuff in the loch So hopefully I'll be able to find something here And if not, I'm happy with the image I have anyway And obviously I'm getting out for exercise as well during this rubbish lockdown so I'll continue on and we'll see what else there is to find up here.
was walking around the lock and I came across this big tree or branch or whatever it is and it's obviously frozen underneath the ice but the good thing is there's on the branches and there's just a wee thin layer of snow and in the background I've got some really nice snow, some trees and a couple of big houses is a bit of interest so it's not the greatest shot in the world but I think it looks quite nice I like the shape of the branches and stuff so I'm going to get this one taken and um, the swans are also, they're, they're not stuck in the ice, ice is quite thin by the looks of it um, but they're certainly doing a fair bit of sliding along the ice and then using their stomachs to, to break through it's quite cool watching them but anyway, I'm going to get this sort taken and then maybe try and get one more before we go around a bit just until before the sun sets and in the distance there um, you'll see some trees reflecting over the ice ridge it's really quite a nice shot it's quite tidy and um, there's some soft light about there's no color in the sky or anything because obviously it's really hazy and um, there's a kind of soft white light around so I'm going to stand here until the ripples stop in the water catch the shot and then I think that might be me done for the day but I've really enjoyed the walk it's starting to get cold now as well so um, and the roads will start to get icy, so I'm better heading shortly. But I'll get this image first and the bag, and then that should be me. back to the car and I've got to say I really enjoyed that walk um, it's the first time I've actually walked around the whole lock um, I had no idea that um, it was as nice as that around the other side as well so it was good I'm um, quite happy with the images I got as well uh, particularly the first one I got some nice drone footage as well which worked out well um, but I'm going to end the video there so thanks very much everybody for watching really appreciate it if you enjoyed it please remember to hit the like button and if you really enjoyed it then hit the subscribe button as well so thanks very much everybody stay safe and I'll see you again next time.